This is the 2018 Industrial Design Thesis Show, where myself and my peers in the graduating year get to showcase our capstone projects. This is really a celebration of the students' work. If you've walked around the show, you have an idea of how much work went into these projects. The students every year continue to up the ante just that little bit. And the work that we get out of it, I think you'll agree that it's really impressive work. I'm excited to showcase my thesis project called Lima. It's a search and rescue vehicle for the people of Nunavut. My product is named Solace, and it is construction workwear that is integrated with a new type of innovative fall arrest technology. It's designed to alleviate the effects of suspension trauma when someone falls while wearing a safety harness. Before Humber, I would never consider myself an artist. I, I never sketched, I never drew, and I learned how to sketch, and I learned how to convey my ideas on paper. We learned about design thinking and the design research process, and how to design with the user in mind. And that's the ultimate goal of industrial design, solving problems for the end user. I've designed an ergonomic industrial sewing workstation to help reduce instances of repetitive stress injuries. It tackles a larger problem, which is right now in the sewing industry, a lot of the machines and things like that are, they're really designed to just push product through as fast as possible, not really thinking too much about the actual people who are doing that. And I felt that that was really a problem that was worth solving. My thesis project is focused on rice farmers. What I found in my research was that a lot of people are suffering from lower back problems as a result from manual rice farming. We know that rice is a major export and it's very important. It's, it supplies a lot of the world. I thought that it was important to address this need. I definitely think that the biggest thing about this program are my peers. It's so much about people. It's so much about how can we work together to solve a problem. And I think that's definitely one of the biggest skill sets that we can take out of this is the communication, the teamwork, the collaboration, and how can we come together and solve the problems that we want to solve collectively. Humber's main focus has been human interaction design. Because human interaction design essentially means putting people first, understanding the needs of the people, and understanding the wants of the people and then bring that to fruition in terms of creating a certain gadget or a product. So that is what differentiates Humber Industrial Design from many other schools around the globe. From an educational standpoint, we like to see ourselves as the middle road, that we are technical, but we're not an engineering program. So we like to see ourselves as a mix of the technical and the creative. And to my students, I just want to offer my unqualified Congratulations because I'm really proud of the work that they've put out. I think it's been another great year and I just hope that next year is as exciting and as, uh, as good and successful as this one has been.